Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? It is your boy here with the new series, uh, Watch Dogs 2 Let's Play DLC Operation Episode 1 Automotive. So guys, we're going to be doing this first mission, which is a DLC operation. I have all DLCs to this game, and we are going to, uh, just do this mission, uh, because it's like, oh no, we ain't driving that far, so I'm just going to teleport right over here. No clothes on him. Why? So, I'm going to teleport this nearby coffee shop and I should be close. So, guys, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and share this video, guys, if you really enjoyed the new series. It is going to be called Watch Dogs 2 Let's Play DLC Operation Episode. DLC Operation. So, we are going to be doing DLC Operations. So, I'm going to just take this fast car and go on. So all sponsorship links and discount codes and social media links will be available in the description along with, along with my uh, recent video and uh, playlist, the new playlist for this series. So this will be the last official uh, Watch Dogs series. So the after this one, we will be doing a big live stream for online operations. And that will be the last milestone for this game and I will be finished with the game and after I'm finished with the game I have uh, plans of doing Watch Dogs Sleep and I will be done with Watch Dogs series forever after I so get out get out of get out of our Ferrari and I'm just gonna climb up on this roof and get up there so we gotta meet wrench on the roof somehow and I'm gonna figure out how so don't worry about it so He's telling us to meet him on the roof. So I'm going to figure out how we're going to get up there. So I just know right away. So look at this. That was It was that simple. It was that simple. I'm so sorry if it was that simple. But we going to get up here and get it done. I'm already on the roof waiting for him. Start this mission. Get it done pronto. Guys, I... I this game is also the gold oh, edition. It's the gold Rich. edition. That's why I'm, that's why I have all DLCs. As much as I enjoy our banter and underlying sexual tension, I'm hurt. I thought we moved on to overt sexual So, um I'm going to uh Marcus I'm going to finish all DLCs of this game, and then we're going to have a big live stream for the end of the game. That's just going to be in-game stuff we don't. And then, after that stream, we are going to be wrapping this game up, and I'm going to be done with the game. After I beat it, I, I'm done for good. You all told us, hey, self-driving cars sound pretty. But we have always prided ourselves the reason I have camo on the best. camo on my character is because I'm a I'm a fan of camo and I like camo knows you, knows who you are the kind That's of security awesome yeah. can give you your key That's a car That must be a futuristic car if it looked that good news and drink your coffee so while it safely drives you to work it will remember your preferences and save them right into your biometric profile. For those who opt into the CTOS insurance programs, you get good driver discount automatically and access to fast transit lanes. Sounds too good to be true? It's not. Because at Noodle, we don't wait for the future. We build it. Huh. So they want to add biometric data on top of those CTOS monitoring systems? Yep. Because that couldn't possibly go wrong, right? I mean, we all know how altruistic CTOS is, right? Oh, and insurance companies. And how they would never, ever use our biometric data for their own nefarious purposes, right? Yeah, milk of human kindness and all that shit. There is something wrong in the state of Denmark. Maybe, uh, some daring vigilantes should check it out. Maybe. Perhaps steal a cool car while we're at it? Because, you know, auto theft's always fun. Yeah. So we gonna get this uh, mission done And then I will end the video If I'm not doing anything else after this video So 
live stream. I will be returning on the twentieth of Yo, Marcus. June. Tara. I will, I promise you. Well, it's if something come up, driving. I will let you guys know in the Looks next like video. The lead what happened? On the biometric car project is a loyal customer of Driver SF. Is that right? Sure is. And I just may have set up a script to reroute his ride requests to you first. Slick. Only the best for DeadSec. Check the Driver SF app on your phone when you're ready. All right, we going to uh we going to call up this driver apparently that they want us to call up. It's kind of like an Uber, but it's not an Uber. So, I didn't even mean to pull out my gun. I'm so sorry, dude. Don't look over here and be thinking I wanted to kill you. I'm not going to kill him. So, I'm going to pull this up and what I'm going to do. No, not that. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. All right, let's get this one done. I'm going to call him up. All right, we got him. All right. All right, let's actually just walk over the edge of this because I ain't got no I ain't got all day. I'm going to jump over these rocks and just jump down. So, all right, we already there. So I ain't got it really. That's how that's how we do it in this game. We re we really get it done that way. So I'm gonna need to convince him to take us to his office, right? Yes, but we've already got a plan. That we do. Ray, you in on this one? Well, this is kind of a fast says, car, but... Car theft is always fun. Right. The plan is that we hack this guy's phone. Right. We set off the alerts on his phone, saying his computer at work is getting hacked. Which makes him freak out and race into work. But we won't actually hack his computer because we don't really need to. Exactly. We just need him to think it's been hacked. I like it. Well, all you gotta do is distract him so we can hack into his phone. All right, we about to do, we about to hack into this dude's phone. Oh wow, that's messed up. If you can hack into somebody's phone, I didn't crash into a trash can. I apologize for that. That's my fault. So, uh, where am I taking you, man? Hot date tonight? My girlfriend just broke up with me. How am I gonna get Dang, that that's tough. That? I couldn't hear you. Sorry. He just, said his girlfriend nervous, broke up all. with him. That's this tough. This is the first ride I've done in a while. Yeah, had a bad experience, you know, and took a break. Yeah, I can imagine you'd see all sorts of shit driving people around. What happened? Oh, yeah. Right, how are we yeah. gonna get him to his destination when I even crashing? Last one driving was good, a bunch so. of drunk guys. Mm hmm. All yelling I'm gonna and show him that I could drive a car like some, and not some sort of art mess car up. They were working on. Oh, for that uh, okay. desert festival. Okay. Yeah. So car. So in front the two of, me. of them are yelling so about bus, whatever you are. and animatronics and sand. You take all what day. What kind of drugs people should be on to view their art car? Seriously, they talked about what drugs people would be on to tailor the experience for the right kind of hallucinations or something. Yeah, exactly that. And then one guy. He punched kind of ran into right in the mouth. Uh, what? So I pulled, blood but it's all right. Everywhere. Meanwhile, the guy this who threw the punch is really, whispering that he broke his knuckles. This guy's probably gonna give me a bad rate. I know, right? I want to stay in my so lane. So I end up driving so. him to the nearest emergency room. Who cares if the? Take it easy. That's my fault. I'm sorry. I know, I'm so sorry. Right? So I end up driving him to the nearest emergency room, and get this. Yeah. They both try to hug me when I drop them off. Wow. Oh, uh, sorry. My alarm just went off. Have to check this. Shit! Shit, shit, shit! We gotta change direction, buddy. I'm sorry, but I need to get to work. No problem. Updated the destination in the app. I got it. No worries. We'll get you there. Oh, really? How? How you gonna get there in one minute? 
Shit! Somebody's breached security. Fuck! But one time I'm not in the office. Uh, yeah, that's that's how it always happens. I can't believe this is happening now. You in a rush? Deadlines. One minute is all you gonna give me? Yeah, man, you get that there. Sucks. That don't make no sense. So I'm gonna I'm gonna get this done. Cause he's trying to get there. I hate this project. That's like. Why did I ever say I'd be lead? Uh, can you go any faster? I'll try. Shit. Can you please take it easy? I should ask him to take it easy and rest. Because he's giving me a... speed up? I'm trying it. I'm in a real hurry. I'm okay with you speeding Bro, faster, why are you in a hurry? Please. Dang. This guy is dead nervous. I'm so sorry, everyone. Almost there. I got you there within 35 no lie, minutes, my dude. I'm totally giving you a five-star review on the app. Five no star. Problem. It's my job after. Crazy all. driving though. How can you give best. me a five star? I'm in a rush though. Doing all that was worth it. I was in a rush trying to get him there. Please tell me we don't have to do the mission again. Oh, rip. The mission is that long, for real. Happened to be that long. And here we are at Coda Print. Okay, then. Forget the 35 miles an hour sign. Police right there. I gotta be careful. I had to click calls and rackets. I'm getting out the car right here. I don't care. Lady, could you please get off of me? Clip push it. You better start carrying him because I am gonna hurt you bad. Who gonna hurt me? You gonna hurt me, really? Everyone okay? Here we go. Lady, why do you keep talking to me if I'm not talking to you or making eye contact with you? Time to get to work. I had faith in you, Marcus. It's not like the rest of us didn't. Yeah, I have lots This of one is going to be difficult, isn't Marcus. it? Wow, guys. You oh, all just made my no. day. It just means Don't so tell much me. to me to hear you say that. Don't tell me. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't trying to, to do some anything. breaching. I'm surrounded by clowns. But you love us. Well, maybe just. This is an even in the Ouch. zone. That's okay. It's you can't do nothing to me. Relationship. It's wrong words like love around. Take your time. I appreciate a man who has patience. Well, well I got away with very that. very patient man has work to do. I'm in the building now. So, dude, you can't really say nothing to me if I'm in the building. This guy's gonna really. You're not going to do nothing to me. I just got all the guards killed. You didn't see no lady. You do not want to be here, kid. Call it in. Be quiet. Who doesn't want to be here? Say it again. Who doesn't want to be here? I'll make your day. I swear I will. I'm too good for these games nowadays. I'm too good. I can out.
Yeah, dude, I'm already in the building. That robot, if that robot doesn't see me or turn around. I wish they would. They didn't even see me. I walk right past them. Sector sweep complete. Found it, guys. Great. This should continue. I'm already all in the, the building. Specs and info we need. All I gotta do is Soon put the stuff in there. You saw how easy that was. Wait, what? This guy walks over the counter. He can't track me if I'm not on the floor. If this lady come up them stairs. Do not mess with me. Yo, I just escaped. I'm too good for this game now. That's how experienced I am. Leave the area. That's very easy. If you know how to just sneak out. I mean, stop causing racket. I didn't even use a gun. And I didn't even get killed by nobody. So... They can't really say nothing to me. Cause look, I already I'm guys, guys, I'm trying to get out of here. I'm not worried about if I crash or not. I'm not I'm trying to get out of here. Mission completed. Is that it? Please say yes. No. So, Josh found something interesting in the car's algorithms. Yes. There's a decision-making algorithm. They call it a life score. They fucking call it a life score? A what? It's a method for deciding which lives to prioritize in case of an accident. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. You're gonna like this one. The car's onboard computer has direct access to Bloom's databases. Hey, man, it don't crash my car. According to metrics Bloom sets. Trying to listen to what they're gonna say. Income, education, race, gender. Fuck. Let me guess. Me and Ray get into an accident. One of us on either side. I'm SOL because I'm a young black dude. They're not quite. As you know, I'm persona non grata with Bloom. My life score is pretty damn low. So, in that case, I'm SOL. But otherwise, yeah. You got the gist. Let's look at this and make sure we're done. Oh, halfway there. Let's go. Let's go. Looks like we need a voice print and a retinal scan from that noodle VP who gave the keynote to unlock the car. Right. I'll get on it. Sending you his address now. I took it's five hundred five hundred and one dollars. That's mine now. The police can't really do nothing to me. So I'm trying to get away from him right now. So I'm going to set that waypoint. Where's that waypoint at? All the way up here. Who who guessed if it was all the way up here? I, I think I guessed incorrectly. Damn. Let's teleport ourselves to that restaurant. And then that is just make it easier. Us to find our way up there, so yeah, I'm totally gonna get there now. 
It's up this street. What is this? Kind of like an electric car or something? I'm confused. I'm put my car up on the grass. All right, let's get this power box. The police ain't gonna say nothing to me, but they will. Too good for this. It's just coffee. Just a coffee date, nothing to worry about. Meeting some strange woman from the internet. Internet dating is normal. What if she doesn't look like her picture? What if she thinks I don't look like my picture? Oh god, this is a bad idea. Why did I let Jonathan talk me into this? Oh, it's true. I don't have time to try and go out and meet people. Like, wow. What if she what if she's a noodle employee? Her profile said she's an engineer. I can't date an employee. This is going to be a disaster. Let's figure this out, because I know for a fact. Look at that. That's all you have to do. I got it. I got it. I'm too good. What? Oh, shit. Server's down. Somebody checked in faulty code again. Yeah, yeah, I saw. I'm coming in. I'll be there in 10 minutes. Dang. Got it. Excellent. What, you have fun gazing into his pretty brown eyes? Yeah, no. But thanks for playing that thought, Ray. <laughs> Marcus has way better taste than that. Alright, guys. I think we got it done, haven't we? Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, no. We gotta nice go on someone's guy house. Has. He should. He's a priority one after all. Oh, How dang. Look at his base. This house has the works. Smart TV, smart toilet, smart sink, smart carpeting, smart throw pillows, smart everything. One of those is bound to have his voice print on it. I'm guessing he's the kind of guy who wants to constantly... I'm gonna go up in the front door because I don't trust the back. Because I could sneak my way in, but... You know what? Let's do that. It's one guy's. He even has security. Oh, 
All right, what is she? Uh... That's gonna trigger the alarm. Alright, receive data from that. Got it. Okay. Sector sweep complete. I have to make sure this robot don't see. Can't let nobody see me. You're here earlier. They're gonna start freaking out and call back up. Where is that magazine? Alright, so I think I got this done. Basically. We gotta escape the area without getting seen. So Alright guys. I have his voice print, his retinal scan, and far too much information about his life. All that's left is to steal the car. Which means breaking into WKZ where they're going to be storing it. Dang, easy. Very easy. Ah, WKZ. We didn't even get spotted. Nobody ain't say nothing. And their infomercial about See, the noodle car that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's how I want to do all my missions in this DLC operation campaign. This is how I want to do them all. And I get seen, I get heard. Alright, one more side of this mission. What's up? Time to steal a car, my friend. They have it on one of their sound stages at WKZ. All shiny and waiting for us. Sounds like fun. I've always wanted to break into a TV station. Since this is such a golden opportunity, boys, we should take advantage of it and plant some... Information gathering devices at WKZ. I like it. Keep an ear out. Exactly. I'm thinking some actual surveillance equipment and some software. I'll meet you near WKZ with all the gear. Sounds good. See you soon. <laughs> Alright, we got this. We got this. Where we where we going now? So show this on the map. Uh, I'm gonna just teleport it down this street so I won't be far away. So I'm gonna go to the coffee shop. I'm already at the coffee shop. Load it up. That's good. Grab a car. 
I'm gonna grab this small car. It's fine. As long as I grab a car and get to going, that'll make me happy. Right, let's do this now. So, they want us to just take this. Got it? Yo, wrench. Score! Check these out. I bet they use these during their undercover sting operations. Got any trouble with the van? Nope. But WKZ hired humanized Zulu as extra security after all these bomb threats uh, they received. May I? <laughs> Tell me. How long have you been a kitty fangler? Hey, man, you know that ain't right. Now, when you first saw the x-ray, did you recognize the action figure wedged inside your rectum? Yeah, it was my wrench figure. Figured that was the perfect hiding spot for him. <laughs> wrench, did you give Marcus the USB? Yep, way ahead of you. I uh, was just telling him to jam that puppy into one of WKZ's computers. And I'll take it from there. By the way, if they ever do make a wrench action figure, they better glue the mask on so it doesn't traumatize children. You say that like it's a bad thing. We got this. We got this. Is this done? Right. So plant Mike, put some spyware in the system, and steal a cool car using the biometric data we got from the Noodle V. I miss anything? A few other things, but don't worry. I got it covered. All right. Let's go do this. So... We just gotta go drive. We're gonna drive this little baby car over there to this uh, WKZ. I think it's like a it's like a uh, news station type of thing. So I'm going to go in through the front door. Because I'm a G. Nobody want to say nothing. Because they don't see me. Police can't. So. You know what? If we can't walk in the side door. Then what door can we walk in? If it's not the garage door. They want us to walk in the front door. They really do. I tripped over a wire. What do you do when you trip over wires? I don't. I have full situational awareness. Ally down! What is going on? Get out of here, Skitty. Oh, shit. Uh... Follow my lead. <laughs> Let's go! On my mark! Damn! What's going on? Okay, let's take a what look at you. Hell? If you want to keep your teeth, dead sec. Who wants to kick some hacker ass? He's not here. What's going on? You're gonna get your oh, ass kicked. Oh. Wow. Straight up? I I had the guy's phone triggered. How how did he kill me when when I had him triggered? How? Right. So plant mice, put some spyware in the system, 
and steal a cool car using the There's biometric no data we got from the new. There's movie. no way to get in. I miss anything. Unless you walk I through the front door. That's worry. what they want you to do, and that's what you, that's what they want you to think. So, I'm gonna do myself a favor, and I'm gonna do everything I can to make everyone mad. I have an idea. I have an idea. It's not going to involve walking through the door to get us killed. But that thing that I just did was stupid. I'm not, and I'm not going to do it again. So I'm going to do something tedious. So I'm going to do something good. So it's going to be awesome. So this is how I'm going to do it. Since there's like five people right there in the, in the doorway and they can see me. How about we all? What do you do when you trip over wires? I don't. I have full situational awareness. This is something you learn when you've been. What is happening? Oh my! That's what we need to do. All right, let's do this.
I think this was just another bus. <laughs> nice. People try so hard to get into your head, and I get it. That's their job. But they just fail so hard. This one was trying so hard to be my friend. It's not like that hostage negotiator movie we saw. Remember what? That one? Yes? The negotiator tries to be all out of control. Are you serious? Oh, this is unbelievable. Oh, no, no way. You think I'll let this... <laughs> Time to hurt. Did I hear that? <laughs> Someone's got to teach you a lesson. <laughs> Alright, we about to do this. Alright, let's get this show on the roll. That'll do it. Done. You you should you shouldn't be here, buddy. So all the enemies that should be No more enemies. Let's go. And Mike Planet. All right, that's a nice looking car, though. I like the way that that car looks. It's from the future. Open car. And like magic. Ka-ching! Dang, we took it. Shit, man, the car I, isn't I responding. Hi, who, what now? Wrench, hit in the game. I'm trying to turn the wheel and nothing is happening. How the hell am I supposed to drive the damn car? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, it might be voice control. Just talk to it. Talk to it? You gotta be joking. No, just talk to it. Uh, drive car. Seriously? Exit the building. Closest exit point. Drive it. Shit, not through the window! Uh, I was a much better car voice. You were totally a fake car voice, but yeah, yeah you, you were better. Oh, Jesus, turn, turn! Dang, yo. Squad, be advised that a possible suspect or suspects. Get me the hell out of here. All right. Without. Whoa, hold it! Without killing me. All appropriate safety protocols will be followed. Man, that's what I'm afraid of. How do I revert you to manual control? I don't understand the question. Ah, I need help! I'm gonna try to hit it! Without killing me! I'm in trouble here! Wow! It killed me! How am I supposed to escape the police if the car is... Voice control. Squad, we have alerts of a hostile in your area. Get me the hell out of here. All right. Without killing me. All appropriate safety protocols will be followed. Man, that's what I'm afraid of. How do I revert you to manual control? I don't understand the The boat, the car is so I'm in trouble here. darn bad. Why can't it move? Why can't it move if it's voice control? Oh my god, I hate voice control cars. Be advised, we have reports of a violent Get me the hell out of here. All right. Without killing me. All appropriate safety protocols will be followed. Man, that's what I'm afraid of. How do I revert you to manual control?
I know. I can't get control of the fucking wheel. You try asking the car to give you control? Yes! It didn't understand the question. Well, bypass the self-driving system. Are you a hacker, or aren't you? Yeah, yeah. All right, I can do this before I get shot. Getting shot is inadvisable, and we'll raise your insurance premium. Ain't nobody ask you? Oh, no. What is this? Yo! It crashed me while in the middle of hacking. How, what? How are you supposed to drop in hack? That's like a multi thing. Bro, no control whatsoever. All right. Without killing me. All appropriate safety protocols will be followed. Man, that's what I'm afraid of. How do I revert you to manual control? I hate self-driving cars. If they make them like that in the future. What are you doing? It can't escape. Wow. How many times are you going to do this to me, game? Dispatch to squad. Be on alert. Get Possible me the hell out of here. All right. Without killing me. All appropriate safety protocols will be followed. Man, that's what See? I'm afraid of. How do I reverse the It's an automatic car. Man, that's what I'm afraid of. How do I revert you to manual control? I don't understand. Oh god, I'm hit. As I was saying. I don't understand. Bro, how can the dark police get out of my way? Anyway, I don't understand the No, you're you're not going to kill me. We've got a patrol car in pursuit of suspect. Uh, the cops are on your ass. I know. I can't get control of the fucking wheel. You try asking the car to give you control? Yes. It didn't understand the question. Well, bypass the self-driving system. Are you a hacker or aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. All right. I can do this before I get shot. What? How? Oh my god, bro. This mission is that hard. Are you kidding me? I see him. We're in pursuit now. You can't move. Man, Xbox, please. Right. Without bro. killing me. All appropriate safety protocols will be followed. Man, that's what I'm afraid of. How do I revert you to manual control? I don't understand the question. Yo! How is that not? How did that police car kill me just one hit, bro? Hacking, bro. Me the hell out of here. All right. Without killing me. All appropriate safety protocols will be followed. Man, that's what I'm afraid of. How do I revert you to manual control? I don't understand the question. The car is confused. I can't believe this. It's confused. All units, suspect is still in the vicinity. Let him... Uh, the cops are on your ass. I know. I can't get control of the fucking wheel. You try asking Bro, the see, it's confused. Yes, it don't know where to drive. Didn't understand the question. Well, bypass the self-driving system. Are you a hacker or are you? 
Yeah. Yeah. This mission is darn All difficult. Right. I'm sorry. I'm so shot. sorry. Getting shot is respect this, please. Please respect this for no you. reason. Finally, I got manual control of the car. <laughs> awesome. Hey, don't even ask what I had to do to get it. <laughs> Finally, can catch my breath. Ooh, ooh, life scores. Life scores, that's right. We're gonna check out people's life scores. Ooh, this should be entertaining. I'm sure it will be. We could just look people up. Yeah, that's the bad fun. thing about yeah, futuristic cars. Oh, yes, that makes sense. Life scores should be visible when you hack people. Their profiles won't have the same granularity you'd find in the direct data, but will indicate high, medium, or low priorities. Suspect is out of sight. Still searching. Dang! Finally disappeared. Finally disappeared. All that time. Dispatched after the suspect. Your data they promise you safety and security in exchange for your biometrics. Using CTOS, they can see everything about you. And that may kill you. Noodle's car uses your life score linked to your biometric data and its algorithms if it has to choose between your safety and that of Bro, someone else. Bro, 54 minutes of a video with just a self-driving car. Are you kidding me? Your car will kill you to save someone more important than you. You may not know your life score, but Noodle does. Will they judge you worthy? We have given you the truth. Do what you will. Where the hell were you the whole time I was working my ass off? Doing stuff. How's my hair? Lynn, can you hit it home? No? All right, fuck you. Oh, no. Oh, well, we're in for a big one. Can you, can you feel it growing in the south? How long have you been an actor? Oh, I'd say between one and 30 years, I guess. But aren't we all acting when you really get down to it? BAM! High chance of rain, people! High chance of rain! Make sure you wear your protection, okay? Jesus shit, Jimmy! Where's my goddamn teleprompter? You know I can't even remember my own gosh darn name unless it gives me on my feet first, right? Finally. Mission is done. Mission is darn done. <laughs> Jesus. And I could demand a futuristic car. But guys, I will go ahead and end this video right here, guys. But make sure you guys hit the like and subscribe button. If you guys really enjoyed this futuristic car, if you think it was a hassle and you think, okay, oh, it's going to be that difficult in the future, guys, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Make sure you share this video, guys. And check out the description for sponsorship links and discount codes and social media links. And check out my... uh recent video in my new playlist for this series but guys i will see you guys in the next video thanks for watching everyone peace out everyone